Hi, and thank you for watching. My name is Lars Helgeson. I'm the founder of Green Rope. And I wanted to take a few minutes to talk to you a little about conceptually why CRM is important to your business. What you've probably seen before, we have the concept of the sales funnel, where we have a lot of different people spending time or money, hopefully getting to know your brand, and proceeding down a path where they eventually will start to become customers. And of course, with that, we always want to see them as return customers because of course we want to maintain a long go an ongoing long-term relationship with them. And of course, eventually there will be some sort of cross-selling or upselling of your products or services back so that you can start creating more revenue from them. There's also referral programs and other things that you can create as a way to maintain this ongoing relationship. But the question is, how do we do that? What is the key? What is the component? What is the software piece that does that? Well, the main thing that we do is CRM, Customer Relationship Management. And so we want to look at what CRM is and why it's important to us. What are we, what are we doing? What is this relationship tracking? And so when we look at our relationships with our customers, and by customers, I mean this actually in a very vague term because customers may be somewhere higher up here. A customer's life cycle, as you've heard, you may have heard the term before, the customer life cycle, really is the process of someone finding out who you are and going through the sales funnel until they become a customer. And even if you're not a company that's selling outright a product or a service, if you're a nonprofit, or if you're providing a, maybe a networking organization, everybody's, everybody has customers. Everything that you're trying to do is create something of value, and all of that is built on relationships with other people. So here, with this customer relationship management, the process actually starts way up above. But really, what we want to look at here is the key term here, which is the relationship. What are we, what are we really looking for in our relationship? Where, do they, where does this relationship start? Where does it come from? So let's start first with how someone might find out who you are. Maybe they're going to visit you from a pay-per-click campaign. And these, all these different sources, where do they come from? So it might be pay-per-click. Maybe they, they found you because you had an SEO, uh, you hired someone to do SEO. Maybe they searched for your terms on Google and they found you. Uh, maybe they saw a print ad and maybe you had a QR code on that. Maybe that's what drove someone there. Maybe um, they're a referral from someone and, and that brought, drew them to you. All of these are, are sources. This is where someone might come from. And that's really where they start their relationship with you. Once that happens, they start, they get into your CRM and that's where the relationship begins. And the nice thing about having a CRM and the nice thing about having a CRM software solution, especially one like GreenRope, is that it will hold on to this information forever. A customer may come back later. They may, this cross-selling or upselling process may take months, it might take years. But no matter how long it takes, as long as you're using GreenRope, all this information is cataloged and categorized for you to make it easier for you to have the intelligence when you talk to someone where they re-enter your sales funnel to know exactly what, what to do and where they're coming from. So we look at the components of what makes up our CRM. So here we have a lot of these different sources, but we might have just say, we might categorize website traffic as one part of the relationship. Every time someone goes and visits your website, no matter when, what time, they're interacting with you and your brand. That is part of a relationship. There may be a time when they receive an email from you. Maybe that's an email newsletter. Maybe that's an email from your support staff or your sales staff. That interaction, that communication is logged and tracked automatically within your CRM. You have other, other methods. We have, maybe you throw events. So you might have an event where maybe it's a party where people are invited. Maybe it's a VIP event. Maybe you're um, hosting a networking organization meeting, whatever that is. Keeping track of those events and their attendance is all part of this relationship. If you attend a conference or you hold a conference, all of these ways that people that are in your relationship management database will be interacting with you. We also have um, an ability to do things like mobile. 
So what happens when someone receives a text message from you? Do you do text message marketing? If it's not marketing, is it some sort of intel informational exchange of information that you can do this way? Um, you have telephony. So telephony is things like uh, click to call. What if they call in? Do you want to keep track of that information? All of this should be automatically stored and categorized within your CRM. So it's also helpful if you can do certain things like um, interaction with projects. So are you running any projects? Are there people involved in those projects? Do you want to see when they're interacting with you and your brand as a result of a project that you might be working on? There are a lot of different things that CRM forms the core of. So what GreenRope does is we take all of these things and we combine them for you automatically. The idea is to create a single place where all this information is in here. And of course, that's very valuable if you can then take these individual components and target messaging based on their activity here. So within your CRM, you keep track of as much information about your customers as you can. In a lot of ways, a CRM is like a contact manager with a lot of extra stuff all tied in together automatically for you. So this allows you to do really what is considered the, the holy grail of all of this technology, which is marketing automation. So marketing automation is the goal of everything that we want to do because we want to save you time and we want to save you money. And that is what marketing automation allows you to do. It lets you look at these different interaction points and say, how do I set up an automated process so I don't have to be there to manually send someone an email when something happens? Maybe somebody visits my website. Maybe someone purchases something from me. Maybe someone opens an email. Maybe somebody attends an event. I create these automated ways to communicate with them so that at some point they're going to decide to either become a customer and proceed down the sales funnel, or if they already are a customer, they may become champions, they may refer business to you, they may help you with cross-selling or upselling to other people, they may cross-sell or upsell to products that you're offering them. The more interaction that you have here with your CRM, the more intelligence you have about your customers, the more prepared you are to offer them exactly what it is that they're looking for. That at the core is what GreenRope is here for. If you have any questions about why we do CRM and how we do it, we can show you from anything from a small business to a large business in any number of industries. Our support and our sales team are here to help you. Thank you very much for your time and we'll talk about more in the future.